Right, this is the, uh, the start of my Cloner 2 Let's Play. Where is he? There he is. Um, I love this game. This is my second most favourite game from Tyler Tasmanian Tiger. Um, for good reasons, I must say. Uh, the one main one is the actual gameplay. It's so fun. You've got puzzles and uh, also it's mostly a puzzle game, really, a puzzle adventure game. But you're a cat with um, a ring that can shoot things and hold a girl in it, which is a bit it's a bit odd, but it's, it's a fun game. I don't know what language it's in, I think it's like Korean or something, or perhaps Japanese, I'm not too sure. I'm, I'm going to guess Japanese, but don't hold me to that. Um, it's a really fun game, and the soundtrack in it is wonderful. I really want every song. I've got a few of them already. I've already played it three times, probably more than that. Uh, one of these was probably overwritten, and this is my nephew down here. Uh, I'm going to go for this one because I did really quite badly in it. Uh, did really well in that one. I've got 51 lives. I've only got 9. So yeah, I'm going to go for this one. Uh, hmm, what to call it? I think I'll just stick with it. That's the K. That'll do. Yes. Uh, controls. Yeah, there's only <laughs> there's only two types of controls here. It's, it's a very simple game, but it's it can be quite hard. I must admit, it really can be quite hard. I don't need to adjust the screen. Perhaps a little bit to the right. Nah, no more than that. <clears throat> I really should be doing this uh, outside of camera, but um, I thought I may as well, just to give me a, a little bit of the time for an introduction. Um, I'm going to play all the all the cutscenes. I'm not going to talk. Well, <clears throat> I might do a bit of talking over the top. But uh, not very much, um, because it's been a really long time since I've actually watched all of them. I just skipped them all. So I'm going to let this run for a little while. Meow, 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 meow. 
Right, here we are in actual gameplay. Um, you will have seen that wonderful uh, video there. Um, <clears throat> Popka, I think, has to be one of my favourite characters. If not my ultimate favourite. He's, um, he's really quite funny in places. Oops, I was wrong. It really is quite basic. Um, run, jump, avoid, and attack. There's Popka again, with his really weird eyes. Well, I have just kind of been doing it. I've even got to higher ledges than that. So this is easy. Um, basic collectibles, those diamond things, um, count as one, and the blue diamonds count as two. Um, when you get a blue bird thing, I think those, those are doubled. Um, attack the enemies. You can do a sort of hover thing. There's a blue one. Um, so you can double jump and throw them at things. Uh, <coughs> you can do sort of stunts in the air as well. 
and things like that. It really is quite fun. The enemies and characters are very um, intricate. I mean, I don't think I've ever seen anything quite so bizarre. I mean, I think he's meant to be a cat, but he's got these flailing things, which I believe are meant to be ears. There's a checkpoint. Do a few stunts. For no reason, but you don't get points or anything. Um, other main collectibles are those stars, which you will have seen me collect three of now. Sometimes they hide them, you get invisible eggs that have those stars in them. When you get all of the stars, you get a toy, uh, you get a little plushy doll. Um, I don't really know what they're for, but um, you can uh, have a look at them all on shelves, uh, on the map menu, eventually. Just a sort of fair warning as well, there's um, somebody, there's some guy that you have to talk to called uh, Baguji, I believe. Oh, here's another war. Oh. And um, personally, I think he's the most dullest person that you could ever meet. Uh, but that's just, that's just me, I think. Um, but I'm not going to be skipping them. Okay, here's one of those flying butterfly things. I really don't know what they do. But I'm, I'm just guessing that they double all the points we get from the diamonds. And the coins are lives. I think I'm back. I think I've explained everything about now. Oh, and avoid anything with spikes. Oh, you don't take fall damage either. These are fun, these slides. There's uh, quite a few of them in the game. Uh, they can be kind of difficult because you, you only get like one chance to go and collect these diamonds and you have to go back and do it all again if you want them. I really want to know what on earth language this is. I could just do a search, but I can't bother. Oh, yay! Baguji. Oh, 
do not ya da Here you go. Yeah, that was just one of the uh, toys that he saw there. Now I need to speak to Baguchi. The most boring prophet of all the world. All of Lunatia. Lunatia. <laughs> Feel free to just move on to when I'm not talking to this guy if you like, but um, I thought I'd best leave it in in case somebody wanted to read it. This is a great sacrifice to my sanity. He's got a bird on his head. I've never watched that all the way through. I've always skipped it. 